What's up guys, we're back again with another emotional video from Shane McGowan. RIP guys, he obviously passed away like last week, but one of my loyal YouTube fellow creators put up this video of Nick Cave performing a rainy night in Soho at the funeral of Shane McGowan. I don't know what Soho is, but I know this is one of his songs that the Pogues sang, and obviously he is in the Pogues as well, so this one should be incredible guys. It says, best known as a lead singer and primary songwriter for the Pogues. So he wrote most of their songs, which is, you know, very amazing. That's pretty cool. McGowan's distinctive voice and poetic lyrics played a crucial role in shaping the band's unique sound, fusing traditional Irish folk with punk energy. Okay, so he had like a kind of a, a lot different sound than a lot of people are used to hearing. So make sure to hit that subscribe button, guys. Let me know what you all think. You know, if you guys want to see more reactions to a lot of these videos, tell me what you think. I love a lot of these Irish artists, guys. I think they're amazing. You know, this was actually just down the road from my house, guys. This was very, very close to where I live. Probably about, it's in Nina, which is like not that far away. Probably about half an hour, 45 minutes. So, absolutely amazing, guys. Let's get it. I've been loving you a long time Down all the years, down all the days And I've cried for all your troubles Smiled at your funny little ways We watched our friends grow up together And we saw them as they fell Some of them fell into heaven And some of them fell into hell What do you say? Some of them fell into heaven, some of them fell into hell. So he's talking about, you know, the, the character of people, like if people are bad willed or whatever. This is an interesting song, guys. Obviously, a lot different than the haunted song that I react to with Shea, uh, Sinead, um, Sinead O'Connor. From a shower, and I stepped into your arms. The wind was whistling on its charm. So you guys can see uh, all the people that, you know, deeply loved Shane McGowan. There looks like a general or something of the army. We got the president, Michael D. Higgins. And there was a lot of people at this wedding, guys, you know, or at this funeral wedding. You know what I mean? My mind is shot this morning. But yeah, a lot of people at this funeral, guys. A lot of people, the close family, so... And I sang you all my sorrow And you told me all your joy Whatever happened to that old song To all those little girls and boys
Is this guy from the Pogues? He, he looks like one of the people that reminds me of the Pogues, the actual, you know, the band, but amazing violin. The violin really adds the kind of dramatic effect, you know? Now this song is over We'll never find out what it means Still there's a light I hold before me And you're the measure of my dreams The measure of Damn, so it's like a relationship type song. It's saying that you're the measure of my dreams. We'll never find out what it's like in the end or something. So obviously a very emotional song because they're talking about the passing of... They're at the passing of Shane McGowan. So very emotional song, guys, huh? amazing rendition i think that's like a cover unbelievable so they also played fairy tale of new york which i'm going to react to after this because that's amazing guys you know that's one of the best songs of all time probably the most famous famous irish song of all time is fairy tale of new york even though you know it's about new york or whatever but <laughs> yeah just amazing guys and nick cave was obviously a very close friend of his you know i don't know was he like a childhood friend but i think i think he was a very very close friend of his also another singer or maybe he was part of the pogues i have to look into the pogues a little bit more but yeah amazing guys amazing cover of that song r.i.p to him r.i.p to also you know sinead mcgaw uh, sinead o'connor as well she was um, unbelievable the the passion they had for their music guys is really like no other you know the passion they had for their craft was kind of like no other guys you don't really find that in irish popular culture today you know, which is, which is unbelievable, you know what I mean, because they were obviously very ahead of their time, so let me know what you guys all think, I love you guys all, I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.